Hello and welcome back children to the Acknowledge series by Amit Publishing House. This is your book 1 English Grammar Plus Skills Unleashed Workbook. And today we are going to do chapter 2 that tells us something new about vowels and consonants. Today we are going to learn about vowels and consonants. So I hope that you are excited to learn this new chapter. So let's begin with our chapter. Okay. So the English alphabet is divided into two groups vowels and consonants. In our previous chapter we have learned about capital letters, small letters and alphabetical order. We know that these letters together combine to make alphabet. So, the English alphabet is divided into two groups that is vowels and consonants. So, first is vowels. So, the, there are total from those 26 letters of the English alphabet from the 26 letters of the English alphabet okay there are total 5 vowels and total 21 consonants so how can we recognize them okay the vowels are a e i o u so you have your five fingers there are five fingers in your hand. So first one is A, second is E, third is I, fourth one is O, U. So what you can do, you can do at your home. You can write down A here, E, I, O, U here. And you can quickly remember the five vowels that we have learned today. So it's your homework that you have to write down A, E, I, O, U on the tips of your finger. So there are total 5 vowels and the remaining letters of the 20, uh, 26 letters of the alphabet. Uh, to total we have to deduct 5 from this. Okay. So the remaining letters here are our consonant. So A is here, B, C, D, E, A, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. So the combination of these two brings the 26 letters of the English alphabet. So, from these 26 letters, 5 are the vowels and rest 21 are the consonants. Okay. So, here we are going to remember there are 5 vowels and 21 consonants in the English alphabet. Vowels help in forming verbs. Words. So, with the help of vowels, what we can do? We can form many new words. Words can be formed. Words may contain one or more than one vowel. So, whatever word we have written, it always contains a vowel in it. Some examples are given below. So, next, come to the next page. Let's see what are the examples given. Okay. Words with one vowel. So, there are many words that have different vowels. So, here is words that has only one vowel. So, C A T cat A is a vowel. B O X box O is a vowel. H E N hen E. S U N son U. And K I T kit I. So, all these underlined words are the vowels. So, whatever word we use, there is a vowel in it. Here we can see O is a vowel. I is a vowel, O, E, O, E. So, every word has a vowel. And in these set of words, there is only one vowel. 
okay words with more than one vowel so here there are more than one vowels j double e p jeep so there are two vowels k i t e kite two vowels c h a i r chair two vowels and l o t u s lotus again there are two vowels given here okay write your name by skipping vowel so whatever is your name you have to write your name here and you don't have to write the full name you have to skip the vowels from that okay so my name is vandana and i am going to write it for you v i am going to skip a n d again skip a n and again skip a so this is the name that i am getting after skipping all the vowels from my name okay does it have any meaning now what do you think is there any meaning of this no so you also have to do the same you have to write down your name after skipping the vowels so this is a very interesting activity okay some questions are given for you how many vowels are there in the english alphabet so how many vowels are there there are total five vowels a e i o u okay how many consonants are there in the english alphabet so if the vowels are five then there are 21 consonants in our english alphabet okay hope you have understood what are vowels and what now we are going to do another exercise in this you have to identify the picture some pictures are given we have to identify them and write their complete name by putting in the missing vowel vowels are missing in these names so we have to write down the names by filling in the vowels so first picture yes everyone is aware by this picture we see this every year on our birthday yes it's a cake so the vowel is c a k e cake so a and e are missing here so write it down cake okay another picture is of house so the spelling is h o u s e house okay next is s u n sun fourth picture is of a girl so g i r l girl okay another picture is of a pot so the spelling of this is u r n urn okay next picture is of a bell so the correct spelling of bell is b e l l bell okay so all these spellings we have to fill in our book and whatever we have filled here those words are vowels a e o e u u i e so a e i o u these we are going to write here a e i o u these vowels we have used here okay now in the next exercise what we have to do we have to circle the vowels from the given list of letters here some letters are given and what we have to do we have to circle the vowels means all these if come if these come in this we have to circle them so in the first line p l a a m g k no there is nothing else left i c f h j u okay t e n o s w so all the vowels are here a e i o u so we have circle all the vowels that are in this exercise okay 
Was it useful? Were you able to learn about what are vowels? Okay, good. Okay, now come to the next exercise. In this, we are going to learn about the consonants. We are going to fill in the missing consonants to complete the names. Yes, this is a very famous cartoon character that you see every day in your te television sets. So, what is the name of this cartoon character? Yes, it is Doraemon. So, the spelling is D-O-R-A-E-M-O-N, Doraemon. Okay, next picture is of something that we use daily in our artwork. Yes, these are crayons. C R A Y O N S. Crayons. Okay, this is something in which we can travel from one place to another and it has many bogies. Yes, it is a train. T R A I N. Train. Okay. Wow, this is also a famous cartoon character. What is its name? Yes, it is Goofy. G double O F Y. Goofy. Okay, girls really like to play with this. Boys also like, but girls really like to play with this. What is this? It is a T E double G Y. Teddy. And the last picture is of something that swims in water. What swims in water? Yes, it is a F-I-S-H, fish. Okay, so these exercises we have done and I hope you have understood what are consonants. So, all that we have filled in these blanks, those are consonants. D, R, M, N, C, R, Y, S, T, R, N, G, T, D, D, F, S, H. So, all these are the consonants. Okay. So, it was fun learning vowels and consonants in this chapter. I hope you have understood the vowels and consonants. Also we, have, we did the alphabets, the small letters, capital letters in previous chapter. In this chapter we have learned about the vowels. There are total 5 vowels. A, E, I, O, U. And the remaining 21 letters in the English alphabet are the consonants. So, hope you will do this exercise that I told you. Okay, good. Now, this chapter is over here. Now, we will be, I will be waiting for you for the next chapter. Till then, take care and goodbye.